I said, ah, is I have some juice right here. And we're playing this robot turtle game. The game for little programmers. And you can see this turtle is up to find the jewel. Actually, he's supposed to find the blue jewel. And this green turtle is looking for the gem too. And age is four and up, two to five players. And when you open it, you can see there's like a table board. And here is a surprise, another board. So, well, it used to be one board, of course. My baby brother ripped it into half. And we'll set up the board. You just open it like this. It was connected right here and open one first and then open the other. I used to do that, but now we just open one at a time and then just snatch it together. Now, of course, there's instructions. And you can see here on the bottom, this is English. And you better watch closely if you buy this game and you really, really want to play it right now. Your parents need a lot of time to read their instructions, just like I did. That was very frustrating. And well, if that happens to you, you can watch this video and you can let me be your instructions. You just listen to this video and you just know how to play it now. Now let's start. Today I'll pick red. We got level two and one. We're going to do together today. And this is level three. This is a little hard uh, or bigger than me. The instruction says, pop out of these and now uh, pick a color, matching turtle, gem, turtle and gem. No, no, yes, two. No, no blue, no blue. No blue. Now level one is very easy, very easy, and you have to pick a ladybug too. Right here. Now I all have red. I'll put my ladybug right here. Um, here's the gem. Put the gem with your parents. And then your parents will put the gem to somewhere they want because this is a little programmer game you can't touch your turtle put your turtle right on this turtle but you have to look closely for red and pink because they look like each other and you know why because red with a little white isn't like red it's pink I'm just going to put this here right now. And you can see these different flowers. I'll tell you what they're for right now, not for decoration. You can see that this turtle has went front and then turned because of the footprints. And now it, if you see it like this, this yellow flower is lit up by this light, but these two are barely seen, like they're ghosts. And this yellow flower isn't like a ghost. It looks like God shining. Oh. Okay, I love that sound. Girls thing. And so uh, this turtle is going towards the yellow flower. And now, oh, here. And actually, you can see from here, uh, the color of the flower is matching this color of the arrow. And you can see this is blue, so it's toward the blue flower to go straight. You can see right here. And you can see this is the purple flower, which is purple right here. And later, we're at the Level two, I'll do these two, what these are for, but first let's do a ladybug. 
The ladybug is for whenever you make a mistake, you can redo your cards. So I said front, but then I think I don't want to move that. You press this ladybug and you say bug or ladybug, whatever. And then you get this card away from your place and you move this back. And the last rule, which is very simple, you can touch your turtle. Then you say, how do I move it? You use your parents. The instructions say, I'm very sorry for all you parents. You get to boss your parents around while listening to them making those funny noises that you want your turtle to make. And that's very, very happy for you who love bossing your parents around, who always wants to boss your parents around. Now is the time in this game, in right now when you're playing this game. You get to boss your parents around. I just listen to them making those funny sounds, which is very silly for parents. I don't really want my daddy to make those sounds because um, we're very tired right now. I'm just going to make uh, my dad do this sound. Yeah, that's not a sound. So I'm just going to do that. <laughs> okay, so let's start. We just put the cards down and we just let the parents move. Go front. This is, this is so easy. Go front. And you really have to look at the correct way. So I do these two cards. Which card do you think we're going to make? If you guess this one, it's correct. So this one back to the deck. And this one, put it right here. You have to turn in the correct spot. If I turn like this way, I'll turn like this way. And your parents do it still. Okay. No. And that's the easy one. This is so easy, I think, really much. And then when you're done, you don't have to ask your parents, you just clean it up like I just did. And now for level two, programming over. Big words. Ladybug. Gem. Jewel. Ghost. This is the number one instructions. And this if you see right here, I think, yeah, yeah, it, this is Chinese.